Hello everyone, Daisy here again with another layout for Spiegel Mom Scraps. Um, I am doing or playing along with the Paper Issues, um, one of their January Scrap Lift Sunday challenges, and I am scrap lifting this beautiful layout um, by Jen. And I decided to change it up, and instead of going with circles, I was going to go with hexagons. So I pulled out. Um, this Amy Tangerine collection, it's called Better Together. It's one of my all-time favorite collections, and I'm trying to get through some things in my stash. Um, unfortunately, this is a collection that I also own the digital version of from American Crafts Digital. Um, I actually kind of prefer buying the digital collection because then I can print things out as I need to use them and not just have them like sitting here wasting space although they are just wasting space and like you know on my computer or whatever but anyhow um, I absolutely love this collection and so I did buy it digitally and so I am using the 6x6 paper pad um, everything except for that one that's in the top left corner the blue with the white polka dots that is a digital paper that I printed out myself um, and I just cut all of these hexagon shapes out and then I did some stitching um, to replicate the stitching that was on the original layout now I'm sorry if you can hear my dog drinking she is the loudest drinker on the planet but um so I'm doing a boy layout. It's of my son when he got to perform at the Oktoberfest here with his band. And so I have a couple of photos that were like really far off photos, but I thought that they would be good for a layout like this because I needed small ones. I did pop a couple of those, couple of those hexagons up on some fun foam before I adhered them down. <clears throat> Sorry, I'm losing my voice this morning and I'm not sure why. So I did back those photos on some of that blue polka dot paper. And then I'm just going to adhere this one down flat and I'm going to pop this one up on some fun foam. And this layout, I'm not creating a shaker pocket. I did consider making a shaker pocket out of one of those hexagon elements. And that was definitely, I was going back and forth on whether I wanted to do that, but I didn't have enough time this day so I decided just to go with the um, you know tried and true sprinkle some sparkle around the page so or spread sparkle around the page um, if you haven't noticed our 15 minutes to scrap Facebook group the name has been updated to spread the sparkle and so that is what I'm going to do on this layout. I'm just using some of the um, die cuts and these are all ones that I printed off um, from that digital collection. I could size them to whatever size I wanted them and they worked out perfectly for um, what I needed. And there's a whole bunch of little music notes and things in there so I printed those off because <clears throat> they you know, fit this really well and just layering things up. Now the two sequin mixes I'm using are called Hexafrost and Winter's Mist. <clears throat> Excuse me. The Hexafrost has kind of more of that aqua teal color in it and then the Winter's Mist has these beautiful blue um, sequins and some really large clear ones. The large clear ones, if you've been watching my channel for a while, you know that I love those large clear ones so those have to go on here too. And I was just showing you there that I adhere all my sequins down with the Zotz bling. Um, I find that they stick really well and it's just so much less messy for me. So just kind of spreading them around, um, picking some different colors and some different shapes. And then at the end I am, um, so in the hexafrost mix, there are these little tiny hexagons. Um, and I am going to put a couple of those on there as well because it, you know, goes with my theme. Now I have been toying with the idea of going back and adding something in that upper left hand corner because I feel like it's just a little bare. 
um, maybe like a partial hexagon or something and some stitching. But I haven't done it yet, and to be honest, I probably won't. But um, let me know what you think if I need to add something up there. So I'm just going to add my title from this Girl Squad um, Foam Thicker. Just going to be awesome. And then that's pretty much going to be it. So I want to thank you so much for watching. If you haven't already, um, go join the Facebook group. It's called Spread the Sparkle. Um, follow Spiegel Mom Scraps on Instagram. You never know if you might be um, featured there. And um, don't forget, you can always use my code DAISY15 for 15% off your next purchase. Thanks so much for watching. See you again next time. Bye!